Sifu Terrence Walker was my big brother in Kung Fu, and more importantly to me, he was my friend. We met in the mid-1990s, and Sifu Walker was the first person in the martial arts community to view me and our school in Marietta as its own entity. We generally called each other by our last names when we uh, were together, and the great thing about our relationship was that both of us accepted each other's faults and focused on what we could accomplish together as opposed to bickering with each other. I owe a great debt to him. He encouraged me to expand my horizons and not accept limitations placed on me by others. He introduced me to arts such as African stick play, African groundwork that I had never heard of. He shared with me many martial arts concepts and concepts also of living in life. He allowed me to train with him, both himself and his senior students, and he introduced me to a number of higher level martial artists such as Guru Dan and Santo, Tifus Francis, Francis Fong, uh, his family circle of martial artists that included his teacher, big brothers, and classmates, uh, Guru Bruce Jolly, who I trained uh, privately with for six years, and three years ago he introduced me to Guru Philip G and Guru Bahati Mashant, who I currently train with. Sifu Walker was a fantastic martial artist who could perform material at an absolutely phenomenal level. He was concept based and he wanted to know that what he practiced would actually work when he needed it. He shared with me and he also shared freely with my students. Walker, I will miss you. I will miss our conversations. I will miss our laughter together. I will miss not having you here on this plane to share my thoughts, my ups and my downs with. I do want you to know that you made a huge positive impact on my life and the life of many others. I can still hear your voice and I will always cherish the time we spent together. Rest in peace, my friend.
step and grip and walk out and on, and on horse. Thank you. 